The remains of the late Dinesh Afta, a Colombo-based businessman who died under mysterious circumstances, were exhumed based on the request made to court by the Committee of Medical Experts appointed to investigate the death of the late businessman. Over the past few days, a security detail was assigned to the grave site of the late Dinesh Afta at the Burella Public Cemetery and on the day of the exhumation, it was further increased. Chandra Shafta the father of Dinesh Shafta and several family members were present as per the court order. The five-member committee of medical experts appointed to investigate the death of the late businessman observed the exhumation and the remains were thereafter moved to the Karapitiya Teaching Hospital for the second post-mortem examination. On the 15th of December 2022, Shafta was found with his hands tied and strangled inside his own car at the public cemetery in Borella and he died while receiving treatment at the intensive care unit of the Colombo National Hospital that same night. Night. Dinesh Shafta was considered as a giant in the country's business sector and his death sent shockwaves across Sri Lanka due to the mysterious nature surrounding it and questions that arose. The preliminary autopsy report stated that the death occurred due to strangulation with a string. But after receiving the toxicology report, the judicial medical officer informed court that there was another reason behind Shafta's death while presenting the complete post-mortem report. It was mentioned that cyanide poisoning also caused the death of Dinesh Shafta. It was reported that Shafta had consumed a snack mixed with cyanide and there were traces of cyanide in his abdomen and blood. President's counsel Anuja Premaratna, who represented the family of Dinesh Shafta, said that there are contradictions in the autopsy reports. Accordingly, the court appointed a five-member committee headed by Asela Mendis, a forensic specialist of Colombo University, to probe into the death of Dinesh Shafta and ordered them to conduct an inquiry and produce a report. A few weeks after that, the five-member committee of medical experts informed the court that the body of Dinesh Shafta should be exhumed and investigation should be conducted. Accordingly, on Thursday the 25th, the body of late Dinesh Shafta was exhumed. All parts of the corpse are examined in the post-mortem and all of these remains were taken away. There was no final conclusion on how this death took place. The post-mortem is being held as part of the ongoing investigations. It is only after all of this that the reason for the death can be ascertained. We have not reported facts to court on how the death took place.